Who's hitting the streets today, building community connections in downtown Mesa. We are celebrating the holiday season with live music and shopping while taking a stroll down Mary Main Street. Well, Rachel Cole, that is. She is joining us now with an inside look at all the festivities. Are we going to get to see Santa, Rachel? Maybe if you've been mostly good, which is one of the options here that you can fill out on your letter to Santa. It also wants to know how old you are, which stopped me in my tracks. So I just said, forget <laughs> it. And I just decided to make new friends with Ollie and Harper. What did you guys request from Santa Claus? Um, walkie talkies. Okay, Harper, what about you? And I wanted so, uh, some high heels. Okay, okay, but what did I say? Maybe, maybe just wait a few more years for high heels, right? But you just said, yeah, look at that face. Oh my gosh, if that was my own kid, that eye roll was fantastic. Okay, let's go visit Santa Claus and make sure that he knows, because obviously you guys are going to put those letters in the post, uh, post mailbox over there, which is perfect. Wait, we'll do it after. Come on, come with me. Trust me, Ollie. Okay, it's perfect because this is an old 1936 post office that has been renovated. It is so magical. We're going to go make our way to Santa Claus. Come on, I'm getting so excited. Ollie can't wait. Their third sibling, who um, respectfully declined to do an interview and is also three years old, um, is over here. Here's Miss Vanessa. Vanessa, what's so special about Mary Main Street, not to mention all the vendors outside? Yeah, I think Mary Main Street is special to Mesa. It's a signature event that the city does every year. Um, it's just full of fun, festivities. I think it's a great way for a community to come together. Another great way for a community to come into the post and have exposure to what the space is going to be. Celebration space for our community. And so we're really excited to host Santa, uh, to have our community come in, have the kids here, um, write letters to Santa, um, be able to um, have exposure for our merchants, our local downtown merchants. I mean, it's just a great place to be for the holidays. Super cool. And a photo op at every opportunity you guys we're, we're gonna see if we can get over here and see santa claus okay can we be next careful watch your step hold your stuff all right we're gonna wait our turn but what's cool is if you already got your photo with santa you can hit the ice rink it's six thousand square feet of fun again we have all the community vendors out there with every homemade trinket ladies what's your favorite of the vendors there was soaps recycled uh, wine bottles turned to candles now chocolate. Oh, yes. anything with our chocolate. coffee Oh, or coffee, okay, or both, it, right? Yeah, right, I put made chocolate together. coffee for breakfast this morning. What, yes. and how do you make that? I put her her Christmas present, with, which was a, a chocolate snowball. Oh, like, and a, like a bomb. You, well, sort of, it was in a little glass and I put it in the cup and added coffee and woo! Oh, women after my own heart. Chocolate and coffee, yes, 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 please. Okay, it looks like it's our turn. Now, Dad's over there, and uh, Jax is asleep, but you guys get on up there and tell Santa what you like for Christmas. Hi, Santa. They're going to get a few words in with Santa Claus, but, you know, Tram, as, as promised, there he is, the big guy, taking requests all uh, weekend long. And, by the way, he'll be here until January 6th hanging out, so you can come enjoy Mary Main Street until then. It's so magical. I know. And look at the kids with the with the. Oh, Rachel, I love it with their cute little list in hand oh. telling Santa. Yep. Hold on. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Everybody telling Santa what they'd like for Christmas. And on there they said what they're thankful for, their family. Mm. Oh, my God. I, I literally have chills, Rachel. That is so, so touching. And that post office, my gosh, it's gorgeous. They're right. so I should have given you my They did a beautiful job. Seconds. Just ribbon cut in November. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Beautiful. Rachel, Tomorrow. thank you so much. Yes, <laughs> please do. If you've got a story that you want us to cover in your community, just email us at connect at 12news.com.